people are spending time outdoors now that summer weather has finally arrived. But with increased sun exposure comes a greater risk of developing skin cancer, the most deadly being melanoma. Darren Perrin has more. I think everybody's just out to get tan. The sun comes out, clothes come off. I love to tan in the sun and to hang out with friends. Summers are short-lived in our region, so many people soak up the rays while they can. John Adams depends the on the sun for his livelihood. He's an apple grower. The sun may be good for fruit, but perhaps too much of a good thing for him. Hello, John. On this day, Adams okay, finds you? out if spending right. lots of time in his orchard took a toll on his skin. It's important that everybody uh, stay on top of their health. So we're doing a, a skin cancer screening today, I understand. Adams undergoes a skin cancer screening at Dorset Street Dermatology in South Burlington. And I'll start at the top and work my way down. Dr. Mitchell Schwartz looks for skin spots that are asymmetrical, have uneven borders, and different shades of color. The sunscreens are, are key. The 62-year-old's face looks fine, but a trouble spot is detected on Adam's back. It's a little bit of a concern. A discolored mole that's darker in the center. Dr. Schwartz will take a biopsy so it can be tested in a lab for skin cancer. Early detection is everything in treating skin cancer. The difference between life and death. We catch a melanoma early and we'll cure someone. If it's not early and it spreads beyond the skin, then they're very deadly. So once it's spread, it's very hard to treat. That's why Adams will have the mole removed. He hopes for the best. Have him biopsy it. And if, it, if there's a problem, I'll have him take care of it. Go from here. It just doesn't make sense not to address something like that to me. Of course, prevention is the best medicine. Before you head outside, remember these three things. Slip, slap, slop. Slip on a shirt, slap on a hat, and slop on the sunscreen. So the fun in the sun can continue. Darren Perrin, Channel 3 News, South Burlington. And dermatologists say that you should make sure you use a broad spectrum sunscreen to protect your skin from harmful UVB and UVA rays. Put it on in the morning as part of your daily routine, whether it's sunny or not, and try to avoid going outside at high noon. That's Health Watch, Marcellus.